the components of a pump head are the pressure head, the gland, the bottle cap, the piston rod, the storage cylinder, the straw, the spring, and the upper and lower one-way bow valves. When using for the first time, the storage bucket is filled with air. Press the pressure head because the one-way bow valve under the storage bucket blocks the air in the bucket. The air in the bucket can only be discharged upwards from the piston rod. Release the pressure head, the piston rod will be in the spring. At the same time, the upper outlet is closed by the one-way bow valve. The air pressure in the barrel is lower than the outside and the bottom bow valve is opened and sucked into the storage barrel. Press down again to exhale more air and rebound to inhale the lotion. Repeat two to three times, the air is completely expelled and the emulsion is squeezed out from the outlet. The differences between built-in spring pump and external spring pump Normally, there are two positions of the spring for a pump. The most common position is right between the plastic tube and the collar, fixed inside the chamber, which is called built-in spring pump. Some of the caliber is using clear plastic so that the spring is shown, while some are opaque plastic. The other position of the spring is inside the pump head. You will see it when you remove the pump head. It is known as external spring pump. The good thing for this pump is the product will not contact the spring.